Several stretches of Ocean Boulevard in Rye down to one lane throughout the afternoon, courtesy of Elsa's downpours. Uh, the issues are is a lot of water at the same time, poor drainage areas, uh, drains that are getting clogged because of moving water and moving debris blocking it. Police directing traffic around spots, waiting for DOT crews to mark them with high water signs. As you can see, there's a car further up the road that did drive through and the uh, engine is conked out and we got to get a tow truck to come out for them. Many spots in Hampton still passable but getting deeper. Police, fire and public works keeping an eye throughout the day. Just ask people to monitor our social media outlets. We'll try to post those road closures out so people can be aware of uh, where those closures are. And as storm drains and downspouts try to keep up, a quiet day for seasonal businesses and restaurants. A few folks have been out and about braving the downpours, but the majority because they were working. Like this ice cream delivery man, that could come in handy this weekend. Tomorrow we'll have some post-storm surf conditions that are really going to draw folks out because the weather's supposed to clear up. Yeah, we could see some heavy surf and even some riptides tomorrow. The fire chief reminding people that means you should probably stay away from areas like jetties and you should check in with lifeguards. It's expected that they will be very busy. We're live at Hampton Beach, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.